The Polarstern, Germany's largest research vessel and a very powerful icebreaker, is making its way through the ice. The polar research vessel of the Alfred Wegener Institute for Polar and Marine Research in Bremerhaven is operational at outside temperatures down to minus 50 degrees Celsius. Besides marine research, it's the main logistical link of the Antarctic research station Neumeyer 3 to the world. In order to fulfill its elementary tasks, such as search and exploration of natural resources in the South Polar Sea, the vessel is equipped with an Atlas HydroSweep multi-beam echo sounder. The deep water multi-beam echo sounder transmits a swath with an opening angle of 140 degrees. An area of up to 24 kilometers can be recorded per single ping in correlation to the water depth. It enables researchers to visualize the seabed structure very accurately. As a double-hulled icebreaker, Polarstern can break through ice 1.5 meters thick at a speed of 5 knots. Ice sheets are a threat to the sensitive hydrosweep transducers. Therefore, it was necessary to determine the best location for their installation. In addition, the Polarstern uses specially ice-protected transducers. Here, Polarstern uses the hydro sweep during an expedition in which the effects of floating icebergs are to be investigated. From time to time, huge table icebergs come loose from an ice shelf and drift through the Southern Ocean. The frozen giants can reach down to a depth of 300 meters. While they drift, they sometimes hit the sea bottom, causing deep scratches in the ground, destroying flora and fauna. But how can researchers look for ice scratches? Polarstern is equipped with state-of-the-art scientific equipment, making use of the recently installed hydro sweep of the third generation with its 960 soundings, a clear picture of the seabed emerges at the highest resolution. In this way, iceberg corrugations are investigated in detail. Marine biologists fear that it will take years until plants and animals resettle. Months later, Polarstern is on its way back to Bremerhaven. She's passing by Ampere Seamount, where manganese crusts have been discovered. This area will be explored in detail with the new HydroSweep version. In order to investigate the seafloor characteristics, the back scratcher function with 10,000 measurements per ping is a very useful feature. Polarstern travels long distances every year from north to south and back. It has to run high transit speeds of 11 knots. At this high speed, conventional sonars would create gaps in the data. Due to the innovative HydroSweep multi-ping feature, Polarstern can overcome this issue and continue transit at maximum speed while surveying. Besides the deep water multi-beam echo sounder HydroSweep DS on Polarstern, there are further product variants for medium depth application available. The detection and localization of gas exhausts from the sea bottom is of particular interest for different fields in marine science. In this regard, a water column profiling function has been implemented. Hence, gas flares in the entire water column can be recorded by hydrosweep of all variants. The sonar control room is the place where all measurements made with the hydrosweep are combined. Here, the multi-beam echo sounder is operated with Atlas HydroMap control software. Multi-beam operations can also be controlled directly from the bridge. The oceans are still less explored than outer space. 
the research vessel Polarstan, equipped with the latest technologies, makes a major contribution to exploring the ocean depths under the harshest conditions. Atlas Hydrographic, a sound decision.